Welcome back to another walkthrough guide of Does Not Commute. This is going to be levels 4, 5, and 6. You can click the level 5 and 6 links on the bottom. Now, um, we're starting here on level 4 with 60 seconds. We're going to use turbo and come through here, make a hard turn right there, and go straight through. Now, with our next car, we're also going to use turbo. It's like looks like a little bus. And a second after you start, hold down the right turn and squeeze through there. Get the 20 second marker, come through the grass to slow down, get some more control, then come on the right side of the road and come through here. Now you always want to stay on the right side of the road, trust me, it'll help you in the future. Here we're going to use traction control, also staying on the right side of the road. We're going to get these 10 second markers right here, both of them, and then come through these in between these trees and go right through. Now we stay on the right side of the road because most of the time we will avoid our other cars by always staying on the right side of the road. It just works out that way in most of these levels. Here we're going to use turbo, make a sharp turn here. Now I tried to get on the right side of the road there, I was on the left side. Here it really doesn't matter because you're almost there, but you know you always can just keep it there just to get used to it. Here we're going to use traction control. Come to the left to avoid that truck, then come to the right, make a sharp turn, go straight off the ramp, get on this building to get the 20 second marker, it's almost the only way to get it and go through there. Now we're going to be using turbo. Turbo with this bus right here, we're going to make a, sh a little sharp turn there. Watch out, we've got a lot of people on this bus, you don't want them to die. And you're going to come through here and stay on the um, this sidewalk right there. Now here we're going to be using turbo. Uh, we're going to come through this all the way across the map, stay on the right side here, watch out for that red car. Uh, it actually hit me, but I did not get damaged, which is very lucky. And come through here to get that one. Now we have practice mode. It's going to help you out a lot. Practice mode is amazing. Practice mode, you can basically try as many times as you want. Um, practice with any any armor, tactical control, or turbo, and it doesn't mess up your seconds. This is going to be very helpful. You can even use this on levels 1, 2, and 3 before. You can go back and get better times with this. So if you haven't bought the in-app purchase to um, you know use your checkpoints, then you can use practice and you can get a lot more seconds. You really might not even need to buy the game to get to the last level, but obviously it's a lot more helpful when you have the checkpoint. So on um, this one, I showed the practice mode. You know, it looks black and white. It's a lot easier to see that way, but in the regular mode, you can't see that good. It's a little darker. But I use that just for that. I'm going to edit out all my other practice modes because trust me, I practice a lot on each car here. Here we use um, traction control, come through these bushes. And watch out for that pink car. That actually gave me a boost. It, I guess it kind of helped me. So I even used this car to give me another boost. Uh, but you do want to avoid those cars. Here we're going to use turbo. We're going to come through, make a sharp turn. Try to stay on the right side of the road. Avoid all these cars and then make another right turn here. That one was a little easy, but it depends on how you have it. Here we also use turbo. Hard left right when you start. Come through here. I totally messed it up. But it is possible to get through there without breaking your car and this hot dog car. Um, now here we're also going to use turbo. Make a sharp turn here and try to stay in this road, in the dirt road. You can go a little bit faster than when you're in the grass. Now here we got to use traction control. Trust me. This one you're going to be practicing a lot. There's a lot of cars to avoid. Right there it was able to squeeze through all these cars. Look at all those cars I just bypassed. Trust me, that took a long time to get perfect. Um, you'll be on there a long time. So here we're also going to be using, um, we're going to use traction control on this one because there's just a lot of cars we want to avoid and we don't want to be hitting them. Now we've got 15 seconds left. We're going to come here with our turbo, come through the bushes, and then come and get these 20 second marks to get a little bit less than 50 seconds for level 5. Now, uh, now in level 5 here, we're going to use turbo, stay on the right side of the road. You're, this intersection right where I just passed, that is going to have a lot of cars, so it's going to be really hard to avoid them. And you just want to squeeze through those trees to get to the end there. Now in the red car here, we're going to use traction control and want to stay on the right side when you get that 20 second marker. Because this next car right here, we're also going to go on the right side on our direction so we don't hit each other. And I'm using traction control on this yellow taxi car. And then you know, you go around that little water fountain and you're on your next one. Here we're using traction control. We got to get that 10 second marker and then make a big wide turn to get this 10 second marker and then come through here. Now on this pink car, we're actually going to be using the armor because there's going to be a lot of cars on this intersection and it's just too hard to avoid them unless you get really lucky. So I come through there, use the armor and then just come right through. Now obviously, you know, use practice, see where the cars are. You might not need to use armor, but it's always helpful. In this black car, we're going to use um, traction control. It goes really fast, even with traction control. 
we go around and we make sure we go through the bank so we can get the 20 second marker. And on this next pinkish car, we're using um, turbo as well to get that 10 second marker. Watch out for the black car we just drove. And I hit the other car, but it was right there, so it didn't really slow me down that all that much. Now this car is one of the slowest cars in the entire game. Even with using turbo, it looks like it didn't even do anything. So, um, you know, we're just staying on the right side of the road. It's like we're using armor almost because we're going so slow. Um, and now we're going to be using this greenish car. We use traction control. Come here. Try to go through there. Avoid that red car. Avoid that pink car. You know, try to avoid every car and then come into the bank. Now, also using traction control on the blue car. Make a sharp turn here. Stay on the right side of the road and then come through. Watch out for the red car again and come through this one. We're using track control a lot on this um, on this level because there's just so many. And on this cop car, we're using armor. Look at that. Just got destroyed by that green car, but with the armor, it doesn't even affect me really. It backed up a bit and went on through. Now, on this car, we're going to use turbo. Really easy one. Just come through. Watch out for all the cars. That one's going so slow, it's almost impossible to hit it. And in this car, also use turbo. Come through. Watch out for the other cars. Almost lined up for each other. And you come through, and you get that point. Now, also another turbo here. We're not using traction control anymore. We're using more turbos. Avoid all the cars. Come through. Everyone's just going to the bank to get some money. A lot of bank people today. And now we've got turbo on the final car. This is the nice yellow car. I don't know what kind of car it is. It looks familiar. I just can't think of it. And we get the two 20 second markers. We barely make it with 40 seconds for this um, level 7. I'm mean, sorry, level 6. And in level 6, we're going to use traction control here. We're going to come through, go over the bridge, and make a turn to get the 10 second marker, and then try to get right through there. I messed it up a bit, but I still got through. We're in the black limo. Now here, you don't have to go over the bridge. You can actually go over the river right here like that. It's a little deep, but you can make it. When you get to the tractor, you think, oh my gosh, we're going to have to go all the way around. But in this tractor, you can go at a, at a parallel with the um, mountain right there, hold down the turn and get parallel with it, and you can go over and then you kind of work your way to the checkpoint, to the end point, to get through. Now on this green car, we're going to use traction control so we can get the 20 points, 20 second pretty easily. And now on the black car here, this one is a little tricky. There's a 20 second marker. And with the turbo, I'm going to come through, go over the bridge. I'm just going to hit the wall just so I can get the 20 seconds because I really haven't been able to find a way to go off that ramp that's, that you actually need to because you don't start on that side ever in this level I don't think and here we got a golf cart this one's real fun you just jump right off the ramp do a nice front flip kick flip sort of thing and get the 10 second to go to this end point now turbo once again come here and make a sh make a right turn and then a left turn so we can avoid some of the cars and then here as soon as you get the 20 second hold down a turn it can be left or right whichever you prefer and you make basically a u-turn and you go to that end point. Now here we got um, traction control. We're gonna get the 20 second marker here. And then a sharp right turn. Do not go into the green water. If you do, you'll be stuck and you'll have to restart. On this car, use turbo. You'll notice that it's still pretty slow, but come through nice and easy and right to that end point. Now we got turbo here. This turn is pretty hard. Do a sharp turn right there. Try not to hit it because you need the speed to get off this, over the water, all the way through. And to the end point. That one is very tricky. Practice that on, on that one a lot. Now once again, another golf cart. Turbo. Basically the same path as the other golf cart. Right over the river. Nah! And you get through that river. And try to get onto this dirt road so you get a little bit more speed to the end point. Now, turbo. Where you, we're going to come through. Make a right turn. Try to avoid that blue car. The bluish grayish car. And come through there. Now that one's a little tricky because you'll see there's an, another car that might hit that one. Now in the black car, we turbo it all the way over. That one is very tricky. Practice on that one a lot as well. Now with the um, with traction control, you could actually have got the 20 point marker that was there before, but I like to get the 10 second marker by the gas station there. Now with turbo, this is the car that's almost going to hit the other one that came through. Watch out for that. You can avoid it. I got hit by the green car, but it kind of gave me a boost to get to the end point. Now turbo with the, with the cop car, come through here, and it's pretty simple. That one's just basically a straight on through. Now in the red car, we're going to use turbo to get to the very end, to the next level. Come through the, the river, watch out for the limo, and then come through to get these two 20 second markers with 60 seconds into level 7. 
Now make sure you guys click that link so you can watch level 7 and 8.